Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to withdraw crypto using Robinhood application. So first of all, of course, if you don't have a Robinhood application on your phone, you would like to go and download it through Play Store. Of course, if you're using an Android app store, if you're using an iPhone or any other store you could be possibly using, then you would like to go here and actually create your account. If you don't have it, of course, and follow the steps to uh, create your account of course if you do have an account just go login into your account and let's just get straight into the video so in this tutorial as you can see here we actually uh, have a pin code i just said that the last time i was like using the robin hood application so let me just here type my pin code and as you can see here i am it just for me for zeros of course you can set it like after like entering for the second time the robin hood application so here that will actually be your home or main screen using robin hood so let me just tell you that crypto bot on robin hood using instant uh, uh, using instant cannot be withdrawn until those transactions settles so which can take up so approximately up to five business days so if you have a robin hood instant account you you will typically get instant access to your funds up to one thousand dollars to trade cryptocurrency so at the glance to transfer crypto out of robin hood you must sign up of course as we said for robin hood crypto by verifying your identity and setting up to factor authentication so next go to the crypto detail page which is like actually that we just go and click here at cryptocurrencies and you actually need to hit send of course as you can see for us if we go like here to as we said bitcoin so here all we need to do just go and hit the send button here of course you need it to load a bit so go down choose your crypto of course of course of course now read all of that let's get started you must be a ribbon hold crypto of course uh what wait i must have just maybe a bug or something but anyway all you need to do just go and click at send on of course paste or type the wallet that you want to send it then hit review and then hit submit button button and you'll be good to go so that will be actually for the tutorial i hope you like it thanks for watching goodbye